Hey there, dear YouTube audience, and welcome back to Resident Evil 3 Nemesis. And as you can see in the... I mean, you can see it already in the video title anyways, but as you can see here in the opening main menu, we are not playing BioRand, we're not playing a randomizer this time. No sorry, Bob, this time we're going back in with the regular game, but with a little twist, obviously, we're doing... A another attempt um, at a knife only run. We did that at the big somewhere at the beginning of the year, I think. We tried to complete Resident Evil 3 Nemesis with the knife only run challenge, whatever. And this time we are trying it again. Let's see if we get better results than last time. We're gonna see Resident Evil 3 Nemesis knife only. Here we fucking let's go with the stars outfit. Go, go. And if you're unfamiliar with the concept, concept of knife only, it's exactly what it sounds like. We are only allowed to use the knife for the entirety of the game. We can, heal, we can use as much healing items as we want, but weapon-wise we are only allowed to use the knife for the entirety of the game. Which actually is doable. There's just one, well, about like two parts that are actually just extremely... But one is tedious and the other one is like really skill intensive. Tedious one is stabbing Nemi, I think it's literally like 81 times in the clock tower fight. And then we have the mayor statue room. And that just sucks because the camera angle there is garbage. September 28th, but that's probably just a me problem. The monsters have overtaken the city. We'll see. Mainly also about the layouts that we get, if it's like <clears throat> a little bit more easy or a little bit more doable. So we have the handgun bullets back there that we should all need, so we just grab the mouth spray. We discard the handgun and the reloading tool. And a good thing also about the knife only run is that usually your inventory is pretty... Um, and we can pretty much grab everything that you need key item wise because you literally only have like the knife usually and for me it's like four healing items because I'm bad. Uh, but yeah, like, stuff like... Actually, I'll put the knife right here. Um... I'm gonna... I don't need a mouse spray at the beginning. Pretty sure. Because the thing is, like, yeah, we have, like, the gunpowders, we have bullets, ammo, whatever. Weapons. We don't need all of them. So usually our inventory should be pretty clean. Also, kind of strike logic, you want to fast up with a knife. And the beginning is pretty much the same as every uh, speedrun, pretty much. With the addition of me grabbing every healing item I can because I need it. So we trigger them, we go out, make sure they're not turbo anymore. Good RNG, perfect. They should come out. Yup, yup, yup. Ah, uh, beautiful. Sorta. Of. First E dodge. Second. Third. Fourth. I was about to say, it's all to the point where I don't hit it. You know? But, okay. He sorta of complied. Let's run! Good. That's some good layout, actually. Get him on the stairs. Yep. Even turn him around. Oh, bad. Okay. Shit on the bed. Okay, good. Big E. Notorious Big E. <laughs> right out. <clears throat> Not too bad. Not too bad. Got some E dodges in. Okay, one turbo, which is not too good, but shouldn't be of any concern. And for a second, I thought they stopped snacking there, but thankfully they didn't. Uh, the guy that went turbo, he can go back to normal, but if he keeps up the pace, he might stand in front of this little plateau here, but knife has reached, so not a big deal. We can just knife him to death. If push comes to shove... Not sure if that was the other one that went turbo. 
Could be. Wait, okay. Oh, turbo, nice. Count the turbos that we got, that we get. Because that's always cheap mass. Just ignore Brad. Go on. Waste an ammo, dude. Waste an ammo. Good on him. So we don't need to come back here because there are only grenade rounds in that uh, shutter that we obviously are not allowed to use. Uh, 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 uh. Do -do -do -do. I think that's good RNG. Never hit on the first shits. So we have um, red herbs back there, but I don't think we need them. Because we don't need to come back to Dario, but we can, but I don't think there are any zombies. The zombies are bursting through like the fucking glass if we go up to the pallet, I think. That's when the zombies spawn in. And if we don't go there, I think we can just grab the red herbs for free, but... Do we desperately need them? Maybe not. Speaking of red herbs, um... There could be red herbs in the room before you find the Jill card, and there are usually either zombies or perros. And if the red herbs are there, that sucks. Because I don't think it's worth it to get them, but if it's in front of the star's office, then obviously that's good, because that's free. <coughs> And we can just dash into the RPD because I don't need anything from Nemi or from Brad. So we just ignore him. Power dodge! Ooh. Mm -hmm. Grab the shits. <coughs> and then just <coughs> hope that it's in the in front of the uh, star's office. If it's not, then I'm not gonna go back for the for the red herbs, I think. Even though they are pretty rare. We have two sorta of guaranteed at the at stack lot. This layout sucks. Think it's best if I just try to go this way. Yeah. Yeah, because this guy's kinda C blocking me there. So it's either getting snacked by that guy that you just saw, or the guy on the ground. Maybe I should have killed the guy on the ground because I have to go around when Nimi comes out. Let's try... Okay. One, two. Second one on my list. Went from bottom to up now. Bottoms up. Trigger her. Get around. That guy went turbo like an idiot. What have we had? Like four? Uh, wait, we had. We discard that. We had the mouth spray. Possibly two red herbs. Okay. Good one. Nice. Okay, let's see if it's here. If we have the red herbs here. We do! Nice. Okay. Good times, good times. Combine the shits real quick. Combine on this, so we don't accidentally use the green herb, because that has happened before. Well, actually, it would be one more inventory space, but... Unnecessary. So, two items here that we need. First aid spray and obviously the lock pick. Just for curiosity's sake, Magnum, okay. Would have been a Magnum run. Uh, zombies don't despawn actually here, so we gotta be alert. Turbo. I think we are at five.
I'm not sure if that's... I think that's turbo also. Six. Possibly six. <coughs> mm. We have some items on the comeuppance, potentially. Uh, some of the re some of the green herbs. Maybe this guy blocks an enemy. Nope. Oh boy. Okay. That was pure luck that that guy didn't. That I just basically went around that guy and he had to spin around so he couldn't grab right away. But I take it. Ah, definitely take it. Say so only items. Ah, uh, I'm just gonna take a gander and think that we might get the uh, green herbs in the ne in the adjacent room, which is actually three. Um, we're gonna need the lock pick to get the fire hook. Right. I mean, I could also take some ink ribbons to actually heal up, but I'm an idiot and I don't do that. I like to live on the edge, on the knife's edge, if you will. Ha! <laughs> oh. Mmm. Yep, yeah, they're here actually. If they are not here, then yeah, they're at the mayor's office. Not uh, office. At the mayor statue thing. The one room that also gives me a really disgusting feeling inside, because that room sucks. So we don't need anything uh, when the perro comes from the cut, because there is only gunpowder B. Does he have a photo? Not entirely sure, actually. Uh, if the perro becomes active, then I think we just hug the left side of the wall here, and he can never get us. We basically do, do it like this, but he doesn't even give a shit. So they're chill. Which I pretty much appreciate. Yeah, so for now you might think, hey, yo, that's a, that's a lot of goddamn fucking healing items, you know, they're rolling in that though. Yeah. Yeah. And we definitely fucking need it. It's gonna deplete really fast. At the very least. At the clock tower fight. That's where we use the majority of items, I think. But after that is done, I think it's pretty much a breeze. We just have to keep one more thing in mind, and that is during the Carlos uh, Hospital segment, but we get to that when it's time. Language. Uh, healers. Yeah, we're gonna use the fire hook. We get chased by Nemi, so we have to be aware of that. So we have news. So we have Nemi showing up in a newspaper building, which ugh. I don't know if that's worse. I mean, if we e dodge, uh, you know, giving a good, or if we get a good e dodge against Nemi, which is emergency dodge, it's possible. <sighs> It's possible not to get hit, but usually he always grabs me there, and it's kind of like, you know, button mashing trying to get to the door. But we'll see. We'll try. Yeah, boop. Are you crazy? You, you could have barbecued, barbecued both, both of us. That's the point. B -b -b barbecue. Um, should be good. I just quickly discard them because we also need this. Um, wrench is at the cable car. Yeah, which I have to go to go first anyways. Uh, might as well, yeah. Of 
Corsair right here. Well, actually, that's better because he doesn't come towards me right here. He's actually just boop, doing that. Ethan, run. There you go. Good boy. Oh, actually, and uh, maybe if I would have triggered him here, that would have been better because then I have the two red herbs in the room that we can't get into. I could jump out of the out of the raccoon press building here, and then you know you have the the two bonus red herbs. No, I thought I was like one pixel or something like too early. He's not amused. You get your chance. You get your chance. And we definitely get a grab in. I can assure you that. We have zombies here, but it should be not a, to our concern, yo. Let's see. I could have just ran. Oh, man. Oh, actually, that's good. Go for the grab. Nope. Good. Thought you wouldn't go for the sweep, you know. But he didn't. But that was good. He threw us in the right direction. Jumping down? Nope. He rarely does that, somehow. Alright. Boop. Let's make the device work. Oh yeah, I do have to go to the cable car first, because that's the only way to actually get the zombies to burst out of the shit, so I can get the mayor shit. Compass. So the game made the decision for me, basically. How do I make this shit easy for me, though? That's that's my main question here. Actually, I could have done that when I just got the wrench, because that would save time. That was literally just a waste of time, but, you know, I like Stegla, so... <laughs> Might as well spend a little bit more time there. <clears throat> okay, wait, if there's a zombie laying here, that's a problem. Um, because you usually always get grabbed by this asshole. <laughs> Um, but we don't have the layout. We had that last time, actually, that layout, and that kind of sucks because you can't just, like, rush. But this time we can, which is pretty good. So we get perros. Yep, pretty much prefer perros here with the knife. Because that's a f it's free. Ah, I could have brought the cable with me, actually. So we have that out of our inventory already, but... Didn't think too much. Jill, put this on. Fetish. <clears throat> okay, Renchio. Can quick out... Quick out? We can quickly take care of Stagli right here. Gonna heal up because we have it. Oh. Asshole, asshole. Puto! <laughs> Perro go visto. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot. <laughs> why, do I, why do I always forget about this asshole? <laughs> I was like one one room ahead actually already in my mind. Okay. So he comes right for me, so I'm just gonna wait a second, then I'm gonna trigger him if he if this asshole comes down. 
Gut, ihr das. Nice. Got a ground, not a problem. Alright. Oh. They actually also just disappear once Nemi comes uh, for us. Let's unleash the, idi the idiots. Do they actually? Yes. May the idiots be unleashed. Okay, let's see my leash. Let's see if I can actually just give him some knife stabbies here. Good. Well, that guy's terrible, which is terrible. Terrible, actually. Nah. If one of them is terrible, that's not gonna happen. I thought to just kill some of them, but because they, I, they, ah. they're gonna see it. Like when I come back from, um. When I come back from the room before this one, when we when we inserted the gems, the camera angle is so shit that you can't tell where they actually stand. You can tell if they stand in the middle of the lane or on the left side. I think they are stand on the left side, and then you have one guy on the right side, basically, right next to him, which sucks. Sucks, absolutely. Chill. Okay, let's see if I can actually figure this shit out here because I sorta sorta understand the <clears throat> the puzzle uh wait I want to bring that then wait so B should bring it together yes spread out Yeah, that's when three are on the thing. That's when I don't understand it. Let me push push buttons and see if we get... Okay. So, C. Yes. Uh, we spread out. Spread out. Put together. It's with the three shits again. I understand when there are two, but 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 three is when it gets a little bit shit. When you have like three lights at the same time. So we have like three um, gunpowder ace, which obviously we don't need because we only use a knife. And the knife don't be using bullets, nah, man. Nah, man. <laughs> Free? Free? Okay. Alright. Free? Almost. I actually pushed the E-dodge, but... I think it was because... Th this, this fucking camera angle here. This is the... This is the... This is the true... Kick in the door. So we're gonna see if we get. Wait, no. this is free. Um, what's up? Oh yeah, we're gonna see if we get crows or if we get uh, perros. <clears throat> I just quickly get this shit out of the shit, so we don't have to deal with the shit anymore. <laughs> so I'm gonna get the compass, put it in the mayor's hand. Uh, and then we get the battery, we go to the uh, power station. Wait, uh, yeah. And then... What do I say? Stagla. Umbrella shits uh, for the last. Check her in, come on. Shorty the pimp. He walks with a lamp. There you go. What do we get? Crows. Not sure if I like perros more here. Okay, he's standing on the right. 
And now, good luck deciphering if you can actually make it through. You can. Well, let's... Didn't pay attention to these assholes. Oh, okay, that was good. I liked it. I'm gonna let you know what I think about it in my blog. Okay, that guy turned around, but I don't see the other ones, so... Okay. Yo! Motherfucker went turbo, like a fucking idiot! <laughs> Why? That was perfect setup, like, these guys were just, like, you know, slowly meandering to the point where I... where it doesn't bother me. Literally, perfectly, and then... Hey, it was just like, no! Jail! Biggest fan, please. Pay attention to me. Big fan. <laughs> Gotta cater to them sometimes. <clears throat> uh, okay. Wrench? Yes. Uh... This one, I'm gonna put down. Do we have a... Okay, Ink Ribbon is in the next room, so that's... that's alright. Oh, wait. Didn't commit, but I made it. Good. They are all on... On the stairs, apparently. Interesting. <clears throat> Voice crack. Oh, uh, brain suckers. Okay. Wanted to see how long he actually keeps shooting. Apparently, it's like the Eminem song, Infinite. Go on. Stop it. Get some help. Good. Good. This one is actually easy unless I get blocked. Okay, now I mind. That's a different layout. Um, if they are all clucked in the center, then the first attack from them is always puking. If you don't get blocked, you can just run through. But yeah, actually, that's a, that's a layout I don't see that often. So I thought it was just literally the one where they are clocked in the center, but this one is even easier. Gunpowder B? Yep. So literally in the other room, uh, we only have the grenade launcher. Yeah, grenade launcher because Magnum was in the RPD, which we don't need, so we only need the Fuse. So red, blue, blue, blue. And I think other than the grenade launcher, there's nothing else there, like healing item-wise, so yeah. Just the Fuse. And we're gonna keep the rage in the cage here. Da -da -da -da. I'm not entirely sure. I, w I was about to say, if you go here first and not Sadagla, then Nemi doesn't appear, but the thing is like, you have to... You have to do Sadagla first anyways, because... Because otherwise, like you can't go, you can't do this power station facility before Stagla because... They, I think, the zombies only burst out of the door for the mayor statue after you've done Stagla, I think. So that's a thing. That right here is also a thing that disgusts me. But I think if I rush, I should be able to make it through. Sorta. Of. What? Okay, he was close apparently. That should, yep, work. Gotti! Pistol ammo here. Let's not take our chances. Let's not be stupid also in the process of net not being that. And use the heals. The technology. 
blazing chronic through the galaxy. Yeah, you guys build your sandwiches there. Side. Show you the pimp. Thanks for the camera switch there. <laughs> Someone fired the director. <laughs> Uh, we can actually discard... Yeah, this one, I think we only need it at the park. Next. Ugh, sorry. Same case for the lighter. I'm just gonna save here. For insurance purposes. Deus. <clears throat> Cross? Yep. No music afterwards as well, which is kind of weird. Yeah, what was the music called? Cold Sweat? That one? I think it's Cold Sweat. <clears throat> Rather than wrench. More drain demos. Uh, I mean, brain suckers. No drain demos so far. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. The one thing that breaks speedruns sometimes, probably. Going into menus too fast. Let me see if I can... if I need to... Yeah, I do need to. Sort them. So... Two ways of doing this. I just realized, did I check Stagla for red herbs? Were they there? Might have missed them, actually. That kind of sucks. But we have two guaranteed... Actually, yeah, in the next room, and I, th I think. And definitely um, before the clock tower um, where you put the gears in. Metal gear. Are they blue herbs? I think they're blue herbs. Yeah. Yeah. They be blue herbs. I don't need that crank. Stop! There's a drain demo. Uh, we had Carlos gas station, so Nikolai. Box shots at your crew, I never charge. Item here, by the way. There you go. Not now, I'm busy. Got it. Didn't even know that. Was that visible actually in the first aid spray? Because I never knew about that. Until like this year, basically. Oh wait, I don't. That's only for randos. <laughs> but yeah, Aqua Cure, okay. Aqua Cure, Safsprin, Adraville. <clears throat> so, Aqua Cure. Not Qs. Jesus Christ. Powders were actually, I think they were in the restaurant then too. So they were restaurants, gas, uh, power plants, and then here. 